Hey friends, quick video here. I had a, a comment on my chain stitch video that had asked, how am I holding the yarn in my left hand? Okay, so the way you hold your yarn in your left hand is going to be just a way that feels comfortable for you. Some people twist their yarn around their fingers to keep tension. Some people, you know, it just depends on what's comfortable. For me, what I do is I will drape the yarn over my my pinky, my ring finger, and my middle finger, and then, let me see here, so it's like that, and then my pointer finger kind of braces it on this side. So if you look, this is what my hand looks like on the bottom. So my pinky and my ring finger are kind of bent while the yarn goes in between my middle and my pointer finger. And the it just kind of sits there. So as I'm going, my working yarn is able to be just braced and then my thumb and my pointer finger, they work in tandem to hold whatever is being created down further. Um, the second part of the question was how do you keep the chain or the loop on your hook from getting too small? I've noticed that if the loop on my chain gets or the loop on my hook gets too small, it's because I am pulling too hard. There's too much tension on the working yarn. So more than anything, just relaxing helps a lot. Um, if you are stressed, that tends to tighten up the tension of your work. And I know when you're first starting out, it can be really, really difficult to, to relax. Just breathe. <laughs> I know that sounds silly, but if you keep trying and just try different ways of holding the yarn, holding your hook. I know people who hold their hook like a pencil. This is a pencil hold. I cannot crochet with a pencil hold. My life depended on it. So that's why I hold it in a knife hold. And so with the yarn draped over these three fingers and then kind of being braced and then being held and worked with between my pointer and my thumb and just roll with it. So you've got this, flip it over, grab, release. So see how I've got, this is also for tension it keeps it from coming down here and getting real, real tight. I use my pointer finger on my right hand to brace that loop that's on my hook. So if you just watch, stop it, release up here to flip, grab here, go again, flip again. And I'm, I'm hoping that this is helping. <laughs> I know when you're first starting out, it can be really difficult. Um, so this is how I hold my crochet, my yarn that I'm working with and my crochet hook. Um, I hope this has helped. 